as an actor, have you ever had stage fright? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've had stage fright. Uh, I've had stage fright, and I've had a very uh, frightening thing happen to me on stage. And, uh, boy, I don't know if I should tell the story. Tell it. <laughs> oh, I, gotta, I just have to be careful about how I word this. No, so you I, don't. No, you I was don't. In, I don't. Remember the, remember the drunk audience I was referring <laughs> yeah. to? I was in. <laughs> They've all been quiet. You got it. I was working in Woodstock. There's a theater up there called River Arts Rep, and we were doing a Kaufman Hart play called Once in a Lifetime. That's where I got my equity card. And uh, there was something funky about the well water up there. So some of us who drank the well water got a little sick. And uh, I was on stage. And Ann Bogart, very good director, had this very avant-garde production where all the men were wearing tuxedos and the women were in, uh, you know, what do we call them, evening gowns? Gowns, gowns yes. yeah, evening gowns. And uh, I'm real hip to the fashion. Are, are, you, um, are, are you high on weed right now? Really, no, no. Gown, I'm nervous about this story. No, I'm just saying gown, gown is a pretty readily accessible yeah. word. Yeah. Well, where I'm, here's where I'm going, though. So I'm on stage in my tuxedo. I got to do this dan dance number where I'm upstage. And I lean against the back of this barn. It's a barn theater. And I've got severe gastrointestinal <laughs> pain. You know, it's bad. I'm breaking out in the sweat, and I'm thinking, I just have to, you know, allow, allow some of this to go its way. <laughs> and again, su again, successfully, <laughs> I did. And I thought, all right, well, that went well. Let's try this one more time. There's people dancing around behind me. I've just got to be still leaning up against this wall. Again, success, fine. You know, not, not so painful. And then, because it's summer stock, I've got to go off stage and come back on as a different character. So, the third time, of course, the charm. <laughs> and uh, I'm on stage thinking, oh, I cannot believe that this is happening to me. <laughs> so I've got to go, just follow me, I've got to go off stage real quick, grab a pair of glasses, because I'm, I'm a part of basically the Marx Brothers in this thing, put them on, and in a row of four guys come dancing back on like this. <laughs> yes. And I'm, I'm sweating, you know. And fortunately, it's intermission. And I got it. I need some help, you know. Sure. Like, how am I going to deal with this? So Mark Margolis is an actor who you'd know him as the assassin from Scarface or from uh, Breaking Bad, the guy in the wheelchair with the bell? Yes. Right? Mark Margola. So I grabbed Mark's arm, I was like, buddy, he's, he's playing this big producer in the thing, Mr. Glogauer. I was like, Mark, I need your help. He's like, what's wrong? So I tell him, he starts laughing, helps me go get changed, get a new tuxedo that's too small for me for the second act. And uh, he was the only one who knew about that until I told this story right now. <laughs>